The United Food Bank is not just about distributing food, it's about being a good neighbor. And we have one standing right here. This is Karen Scoggins. And Karen, you love what you do. You've been working out here for a couple of years. Uh -huh. Tell me what you do on a day-to-day -day basis. Oh, um, put out fires. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the world of business. <laughs> yes, and get out as much food as we can. Yes. I work with over 200 agencies and anything and everything that they need and bringing them together with all the different departments within United Food Bank to make sure that the food that comes out can go, comes in, can go back out again and get to the, all the agencies in our area that need to help everybody. There's a lot of coordination that goes on. When yeah. people come to the distribution center, how do you help them? Walk me through what, what happens. Well, a normal distribution, we take our food out, we line it up, and then we have people come in, sign our paperwork, and we walk them through, and we talk to them, we say hi, chit chat a little bit, but we try to keep it moving and, and help them out as much as we can. But we get a lot of people. Yes, and that brings me to my next question is, if people want to help, how can they help you help our community? Well, money is always great. We can buy a lot of meals with a little bit of money. We take all the food donations, everything. Anything that is non-perishable really helps right now, proteins. Um, and volunteers, we always need volunteers. And if, uh, if somebody, even in an outline area, hears this and wants to help, we have agencies all around and, and our our, our base is getting to be seniors and they're getting tired. Yeah. We always can use as volunteers. It's huge. Yeah, absolutely. You had mentioned proteins and give me more things on the list that you're always looking for, for and especially this time of year. This time of year. Well, anything, uh, canned proteins, beans, meats, chicken, anything that's shelf stable is awesome. Um, we don't have to worry about it being perishable. So those are really the best things that we could use right now. All right. And we are always running low. so bring them in absolutely are yeah. you still driving one of these on and off are you mm -hmm. yeah. do you miss that when you're not doing it no but I, I love it when I am I would love doing yeah, that as well because it's it's kind of all around I get to do everything yeah. Yeah. thank you for being one of our community heroes you're welcome thank you for helping us out absolutely and right now if you'd like to help Karen help the community just go to azmillionmeals.org and donate to the United Food Bank they could use your help right now